Right, so let's fill toppers. So today we're going to fill these toppers and they will look like this. So we are going to start with some fourth plate chicken. It's their normal wet food, so this is what they get. When I fill it, especially for the bodies, I make sure it all goes like in really deep, like really nicely. So they have to work actually for it and really work to get it out of the obstacles. So this is all done. Then we're gonna get and add in some natural yogurt. got this one here I have just popped it in the freezer this is actually um, like a homemade treat it's just sweet potato cooked and then squashed and then popped in a bag to dry so I can have like these fancy bits I thought they would look cute and I would just add them on they like it so yeah I'm going to add this in I mean you might want to try with your dog what your dog actually does like so for us it's this one I didn't have any room in the freezer so I just popped it in a bag to just create like tiny bits and pieces rather than having like cute, um, like you know, like paw shaped ice cubes or something. And then we add these ones here and they are bone shaped homemade treats. So they are spinach and sardines because my dogs don't like spinach. So, um, and I want them to actually eat the spinach. So they get them and they are, um, yes, as I said, homemade with sardines added in. I mean, how cute do they look? Like? They're super cute. They are so cute. I love them. And then lastly, we just add in the beef coins from JR Pet Products. I've shown you these ones already in the last video, so we're still using these. I actually like to add them in until one of the packages is empty, so we're not wasting anything. And yeah, they are quite cute. And this is the final result. Everybody, eins für den Chucky Bear. There you go, my love. And eins für die Panda Maus. There you go, my love. Bitte schön. Ui, yummy.